Hello guys, um, today I'm doing a review on the Siku Coon Hedge Cutter, which you probably will get a lot of views on this video, and you're probably surprised I even got it. But anyway, yeah, let's get started. It is the Siku Coon EP7483TP Prolonger G2, or G11, or whatever it says. Right there, you see the G at the end? Right there. Um, coon, and then obviously like the little air vent where the noise comes from there. Was that my phone? No, it wasn't my phone by the Um, sorry, and then it says coon at the top of there, coon there, which is pretty coon. Sorry, I had to make that joke, I'm sorry. Didn't have to, I chose to actually. Now you got coon there. Um, This will be used in the next little farm video that I'm about to make after this video. You can lift it up. That's as high as it'll go. Which is pretty high. And then you can obviously put it to the top like that if you want to. And then obviously if you want to, you can bring it down. And you can go like that. But you have to be pretty far away. And then you can just put it like that. And then you can do the hedge like that. It does go all the way to the back. And it goes all the way over to that. And then you can spin it back around. So yeah. Um, if I bring it down. Um, and then the blades obviously move. Um, so yeah. Um, so yeah. This. Is not the only thing I've just bought. I've bought a pheasant from HLT Miniatures, which is, I think it's a standing one, it's just standing, so that will be coming soon, um, and my dad's uncle, his wife's come over, and I've asked for yard a standard yard scraper, a vintage tractor and some ducks, but he did say I've got a, y a standard yard scraper, if you want it, so I think he might have that, I don't know about the tractor. I don't know about the ducks, but I did message him, so, um, yeah, um, I think that's practically it, obviously you have the, where the linkage goes there, and then obviously where it goes down here, um, so yeah, I asked my dad if it was too, like, the head cut, and he said no, so, yeah, oh yeah, and, uh, the grass there, it's like the hedge there, you, I keep on thinking it's gauze. Well, I call it gauze, and it's all actually gauze, but I'm like, I'm wondering to just say it's a hedge. It's an uneven hedge. That would be cool, because that means I can actually have a hedge to cut. Um, so yeah, that's there. We have a little bit of a problem with the double bail lifter. You might be thinking, oh no. Um, I was going downstairs. With my bale lifter where it can like, do you know how it can like, this bit here can tilt forwards, if you press this button there's something right here that pushes this forward like that, yeah it's broken, it was like that when I went downstairs, oh sorry, it was like that when I went downstairs and I dropped it. And it snapped, and I lost a screw. So it needs a little bit of metal glue there so it can stick. And then here, it just needs the screw to be put back in. Okay, I've got in this little tub here, as you can see right there, which I might get the screw in tonight. So yeah, it's just my dad was a little bit mad, and I was like, he said, it's like almost every week that you're breaking something. It actually was because he's actually mad at He's so, he feels sorry for me because I've spent a lot of money on these and I'm accidentally breaking them. He said, don't break it on, on this. Um, so yeah, and the pigs, we were put in the second pen yesterday and they broke out. See so yeah, lovely jabbly. <coughs> white cock was in there. I put the black one no tail, which is an ostrilop. My brown hen and white hen in with him last night. And tonight I put, he was in there. The black one no tail, white hen, light brown hen, grey chick, and the black hen in there tonight. 
but I obviously need to do that as you can see. We've run out of corn so we only have pig nuts so whoever's out gets fed with the pigs. But the geese won't fly out their penny. So, yeah. And that's the amount of ducks I have down there. So, yeah. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Try to keep it up. And bye.